All right, I want to demonstrate how uh, we could revert to an old commit on a GitHub Pages site. So let's say I make some changes and push them on my master branch so they show up on my GitHub Pages, but I decide that I want to go back to something that I had committed before. So uh, I've just been reading about this, so I'm going to try it out. Um, so this is GitHub Pages. I've already cloned. I've got this a local copy of it, so I also have my... Uh, index.html on disk. So we'll look at this for changes before we push to GitHub. So uh, I've got it open in VS Code and what I'd recommend doing, according to what I've read so far, uh, we can do git log, and this is something I use a lot to go through old commits. Uh, you can kind of read the dates and read the commit messages of what you changed. So I've been messing around with this today. I don't like any of my changes. So I wanna move everything back to this old commit. So I'll copy this identif identifier, this hash. And, and by the way, you don't even have to copy the whole thing. Um, you can just git log, go back to the one that I like. Just copy the first few characters will be enough. It just has to be enough to tell it it's unique. Uh, so I'm on master and I don't want to be, I wanna to go to that old commit. So first thing we'll do is git checkout and it says you're in a detached head. Head is now at 1D980, which means if I reload this page, it'll be back to where it was before. Um, so I say, okay, this is good. I want to use this as my head. And there's lots of strategies for this. Um, some of them just involve like resetting and kind of force pushing uh, and kind of destroying your history. Uh, I like the sound of this other strategy, which is to git merge using the strategy ours. So this is a merge option, git merge dash s ours. And then we're gonna merge the current branch back to master, or rather we're gonna merge master into um, this detached head. So let's try it. Merge made by the ours strategy. And if I do git status, what are we looking at? Uh, we're in a new commit um, and we're in head detached. So I'm gonna copy where am I? Git branch master into head. So I'm gonna take this commit, D7, quit git log. I'm going to git checkout uh, master and now git merge that new commit. And it's fast forward, two files change. So I'm back on master now and I'm ahead of my remote. So on, if I'm on my local branch, my local file looks like how I want, great. And my remote hasn't been pushed yet, but I'm one, uh, one commit ahead. So let me go ahead and get push. And that ought to do it. If I clear my cache, uh, network, dev tools, disable cache, refresh, uh, disable cache, refresh. Okay, it's fine, everything's good. It was just, took a second to propagate. Um, yeah, so that, that, that works. So let's take a look at my git log and um, change my mind burgundy, this is no good. And then we have merge branch master into head. And that is what made those changes. Uh, so let's review, let me go back here. What, did, what all did we do? We said git log, looked at the backlog, git status, figured out where we were, git checkout, the commit that we liked, git merge dash s hours master to merge um, an overwrite master with the changes we liked. And then we checked out master and merged that new commit and then pushed. So that's what worked for me. There's a 